Jerk competition for the men's 85 kilo championship underway inside the exhibition and convention center and you can see it's early days uh, Mishkovets and Rychkowski of Poland on 200 and just to put this in uh, context the clean and jerk world record 218 kilos uh, held and set by a uh, Zhang Yong of China but an awful long time ago back in 1998 when the records were or I should say the weight categories building up to the Sydney Olympics were were established so it's been around for a long time junior world uh, record 205 kilos uh, set by uh, Kalancia of Romania in uh, 2000 and the total standard of 395 yet to be achieved so here's Juan first clean and joke 200 kilos and Juan as a result of the failures of the likes of Chakoyan and Anishanka and Sunar in fourth place at the interval and pretty close to the still to come into this competition cleans the bar with a close grip stands and then takes the hands wider a lot of athletes do this especially the bulgarians because obviously you don't have to drive the bar quite so far overhead to reach the locked arms and uh, very effective he is too yeah he's going to have to find uh quite a few more kilos to be competitive this is a very very open class though at the moment so here's the man who had the chance to be world champion at uh, the halfway stage with uh, a winning lift in the snatch but it wasn't to be so he's got 172 and a half kilos at the moment to carry forward to try and get his total here 200 on the bar No. Ooh. Oh, well. <laughs> yes or no? Well, he, des he deserves that. He really having problems holding that weight overhead and, and, and not as good on this lift as, as he was on the snatch. Well, I don't think he's going to get it. Well, he has by two to one. Two to one. Well, I think he's pretty relieved about that because uh, if I was him having... Uh, just completed that 200 and having to put the effort that he had to put in really really having to work out of that low squat position drives the bar overhead but uh, has it almost loses it saves it again really really having to work hard nearly loses it there I'll be pretty relieved that uh, that, that was a two to one decision yeah really gutsy uh performance there right on the edge of the platform particularly when he he actually failed his first attempt at the same weight so he's got his total and uh, can now try to move forward 372 and a half for Sunar of Turkey now Chakoyan again like Sunar had every chance to have taken the snatch gold medal but failed twice at 177 and a half so he's also got 172 and a half kilos yeah, but because of all the failures, he actually he actually did win the snatch gold medal on 172.5. Yeah, I'm sorry. Well, yes, I'm... By virtue of his lighter body weight. But he's also fouled with 202.5, so this is his second attempt to try and make a total, which he does this time, so that puts him on 375, and it gives him the lead to uh, snatch gold medal on a plate, really, because uh, there were so many failures and so many people taking weights that... Uh, they didn't really need. I mean, several athletes taking 177.5 when all they really needed was uh, was 175. So the weight now moving to 205 kilos. Anishanka. Yeah, so this would, of course, give him the lead because, if you remember, he snatched 172.5, so this would put him on 377. Cleans well. Yeah, that looks fine. Strong overhead. And with the edge, with the opportunity. But interesting, David, uh, the one man that we uh, haven't seen at the moment is the Romanian... Kalancia, who's got that junior world record in the clean and jerk, and he has yet to 
come out and uh, start his clean and jerk attempts. But at 2.05, which is where we are now, that's his junior world record. So he should be soon or very soon on the stage. Of course, that record was, was, was set three years ago. Well, here he is, Dave. And uh, I'm sure that uh, being a youngster with three more years training behind him, he certainly improved. Well, he's not going to zoom into the lead. Uh, well, certainly not at this stage, because remember, he only had 167 and a half kilos from the snatch. So that's five down on Chakoyan, Anishanka and Sunar. So the first phase has got to be get the total and begin the catch up. So 2.05, this should be, should be straightforward. Good clean. Solid jerk, and that's certainly the most impressive piece of clean and jerking we've seen today. So 7.5 if he wants uh, an overall championship medal here because of the kilos that he's given away in the first part. But encouraging there, and he's got uh, in Niku Vlad somebody who really at the absolutely at the highest level knows what it takes to be a winner. So Sunar, well, five kilos, shouldn't be a problem, that sort of amount. But, of course, David, this is his final attempt. Having failed at 200 the first time, just about struggled to get it for the second. So, at the moment, he's sitting on 372 and a half and needs this badly to stay in with a shout of a medal for the overall no not to be but he's only 21 but he had actually aspired to 390 as a total that's what he put in that's what he put in came into these championships ranked 17th in the world but he's improved that by this performance already it's certainly a name to watch out for in Athens so Chakoyan last chance now to go back into the lead needs to do this remember he only weighed in at 82.7 Zero. So this would put him into the lead on the total and into the lead on the clean and jerk by virtue of his lighter body weight. But of course, he doesn't have any attempts left after this. Absolutely. You know, still Juan, who's alive of China, Anishanka, Kalansia, but really does need this to take him up to 377.5. Had to work a bit for that. Well, he did work hard, and, and for my money, he deserves that lift. Uh, pretty good at the first phase, David, the snatch. But equally, you know, this has always sort of given away places and positions in this second phase. Has always had to try and make it count in the snatch phase. If you go back, uh, you were talking about world records. When he was Armenian... Uh, or lifting for Armenia uh, back in the early 90s. That's when he was setting world records uh, and setting the, the world alight. Now, Juan. Now, this is only his second clean and jerk, but it's a big, big increase, David. 200 to 210. So, if he gets this, he goes to 380 and straight into the lead. So clearly he feels confident enough to go for this. Look good on the on the opener of 200, and that's, uh, that's certainly good. Just slides the arms out as you've indicated. So I'm capable of that. I think the snatch he he didn't expect him to snatch the 175, but he he certainly expected him to do this, and it'll be interesting to see if he comes out for that again. What well, he has done 210 in competition. Not uh, recently, he only did 202 and a half in the Asian Championships, and that was at his third and final attempt. But he's <laughs> got one more left here. Let's see whether he can pull it out of the bag on this occasion. But uh, before he does that, Anishanka with the bar still at 210 for Belarus. And in a way, David, like, like with the snatch, you know, the, 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 he's got it at his mercy here if he picks this up and now puts this over his head. Oh. Off today. All the strength is, is, is there. I mean, he's, I mean, he's standing up OK with the weights. He's, he's putting the weights to arm's length without any real problem, but he seems to be struggling to, to maintain them overhead. 
<laughs> what makes this competition fascinating, David, is the fact that, you know, so many have had a chance to, you know, grab the glory. It's who grabs the glory? Well, you know, where's it? Well, 210. So what's this going to do? This would take him to 377 and a half. He weighed in at 84 kilos, 45. So it's not going to give him the lead because, of course, Chakoyan is still in the lead. But, but, he, but it will put him in the lead on the clean and jerk. Yeah, and it will... But he's, remember, he's got one more attempt. So from nowhere, really, in the snatch, where he was only eighth in the ranking, this is for second overall, and he's very strong. Yes, it's good. Please. Well, it's actually the failures have actually helped him to claw back because he's right there on terms now. Because we have a situation whereby, you know, Anish Shankar's got um, one lift left. Juan has got one lift left, and Kalansi has got one lift left. It's that close. So, Anishanka at the moment is uh, he's stuck on 375, isn't he? And he's in third place. Juan is out of the medals. Well, three, 377, because he snatched 72, didn't he? And he, and he jerked, uh, he's done 205. So. This no. lift of 210. Oh, he's done 205. Yes, you're right. He's on 377 and a half. And Ani Shanka is <laughs> body weight 84.44. Kalancia 84.45. Well, that was harder. Now, can he get the jerk right this time? Well, the answer is no. It's... And he leads ahead of Anish Shankar, who's also got 377.5, with Kalancia, the young Romanian, also on 377.5, but the, the heaviest of the three. The only difference is that kalancia has got one attempt back. And the, other, the only other person that can affect anything is uh, Juan Ayun of China, who actually, David, has got 370. Because he yeah. failed, he got the 200, failed the 210, and has now put the bar up to three, uh, to uh, 212 and a half. So this will give him 382.5 and give him the lead on the overall and on the clean and jerk, meaning that the only person who'd be able to overtake him would be uh, Kalansia. So this is for clean and jerk lead, overall lead, a new personal best. Uh, they don't come more much bigger than this in terms of lift opportunities or lift challenges well he seems again he seems really confident the coach that he can do this which is great certainly the cleans have been really good a little bit heavier but that was still impressive david yes yeah, just needs to maintain overhead oh. he does so as he put that over his head so I'm sure after that lift, he must be thinking he's got it. But of course, we still we can't ride off Kalansi. He's looked good on all of his clean and jerks. And look at that. Absolutely terrific. Now, Kalansia, has he got it in him to reply? Yes, knows exactly what he needs. He needs 215 kilos for the title. He's got one lift left to do it. And uh, there it is. The bar has now gone to 215. So the last lift of this competition. Yeah, it's on, but it'll be on body weight because he is lighter than Juan. So this for the overall medal. Is it China or is it Romania? <laughs> well, like Juan, no problems there. Now he's looked good on this phase. And it still looks good. That's a fantastic finale. A category which has had rather too many failures has ended with some terrific lifting. And look at Nikul Vlad. He's been struggling to get a Romanian champion for quite a few years now since he returned to Romania from Australia. But this day belongs to 21, 23-year-old Valeriu Kalancia, who for the first time becomes world champion at senior level. And the total 382 and a half. It doesn't affect the world records, but that's not what it's about. It's about winning the championship, and that's what Valerio Calancia has done. And also, by virtue of lighter body weight, you can see it there. He's taken the gold in the clean and jerk ahead of the gutsy Juan of China and the old campaigner Sergei Chakoyan in third place. But it might have been.